Hey guys, it's Sim Queen, and this is part 319, I think, of the Aspirations Challenge. I sometimes uh, completely forget where I'm at. Uh, so Malibu is pregnant with Jace's baby. I'm actually inviting him over right now because I'm going to have them uh, move in together. I think the time has come. Um, Jace does have a daughter as well, so she's going to be moving in too. She's a child. Um, okay, we're going to... Sure, blow a kiss. I don't care and share big news i think that we've already done that it's fairly obvious that she's pregnant and we're going to ask to join household we've got a room set up for lana um so that's all ready to go we've got the nursery set up too so we're ready for this baby to come um okay so we are going to move jace and lana and then this is his roommate that i had living there as well um, I gave Lana a bit of a makeover too. Um, her trait is a green fiend, just like her dad. I think she's supposed to be at school right now, so I'm actually going to send her to school. And then Jace doesn't have a job, so I'm actually going to get him to do something. Purveyor of potions is his aspiration. That doesn't give me a whole lot of information. Uh, he's also a green fiend, so I feel like maybe the... Um, conservationist career or something like that or the civil engineer would be good for him uh civil designer that was it we'll get we'll do that <laughs> it did not take long to decide uh because yeah jace definitely needs to have a job um that is apparent um and so yeah these two will eventually get married right now we're mostly just focusing on having this baby um again like i said i have prepared the nursery and lana's bedroom as well um, we do know the gender, so the nursery will reveal that. Uh, as you can see, the room is all ready to go in pink, uh, and it's, it should be, I guess, uh, two more days until our baby girl arrives. Um, I just, I was going to do the sonogram, but I decided I would just check with MC Command Center and then, uh, just tell you guys that the gender is in fact a girl. And then this is Lana's room, which I think is so cute. It's like pink and purple. Um, it's got this, uh, this kind of feature wall, but it's more of a feature corner wall. Um, but yeah, very like vibrant and just, just cute. I am going to redo Jace and, um, Malibu's bedroom as well. I'm not loving it. Um, we need to pay our bills, but we can't afford it. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Uh, the, the vet clinic is currently open as well, so I can actually transfer some money from that. Uh, we'll do another, we'll do a thousand. Then we can afford to pay our bills. Yeah, we don't want that. We want to be able to pay our bills every day. All right, that is all done. Uh, I'm going to go and put some laundry away. Lana is going to make some friends at school. Jace, what are you... You know what we could do? I've been wanting to work on the, the training skill. Lana spent most of recess t running around trying to kiss some of the kids. All right. I'm not sure why we're getting those. <clears throat> Let's um run obstacle course with Dodger. We might as well. I kind of want to explore this skill. This is something that I've honestly, I have not really played with too much. So this is the pet training skill, which right now we only have uh, level one. Oh, and other good news I forgot to mention in the last episode, we actually maxed out the, the vet skill. So we're at level 10. Pet is currently running the obstacle course. Oh, okay, he's still going. Oh. Oh no, he's becoming an elder. I don't want that. <laughs> I mean, I knew it was coming soon. Dodger aged up. Wade, you won't believe it. Annabelle Seals is such a sweetheart. I'm in love. Oh, that's, that's nice for you. Oh, Dodger's our old man. That's really sad. Okay, well, maybe we'll do the, the training with our younger dog. I don't want to make him go through that. <laughs> He's old now. He's still so cute, though, even with his little gray ears, his gray paws. Oh, he still wants to do the course. Okay, fine. We can keep doing that. He's a little bit older, but that's okay. Oh, he fell on that one. Okay, this is making me feel bad. If he's going to fall, then I, I really do feel guilty. Because we have Lily. She's only a puppy. 
Um, but once she becomes an adult, we can get her to run the courses. So that would probably make sense. Uh, not bad, but not perfect. Dodger has had a time of two hours and three faults during their run. Make sure Malibu gives them proper training and discipline before running the course again. Yeah, we don't, he doesn't need to do that again. Let's feel the love. And then where is Lily right now? She's often sleeping on her little dog bed. She likes to sleep a lot. <laughs> And Jace is playing video games. What does he need for his career? Interview a homeowner about utilities not started. Um, I'm not sure who that would apply to. We could have him <clears throat> just kind of wander out into the world, see who we can run into. Maybe interview someone. Okay, there's literally but nobody around. Okay, maybe not. Um, I'm not sure. I don't know if... Uh, if Malibu counts, we could try. Also, Jace hates the decor around here, but that is just, that's too bad. <laughs> I'm not going to do anything about that. Uh, I don't see, discuss, uh, enthuse about city planning. Yeah, I don't think that's going to be on here. Let's go talk about marriage. Uh, we did that in the last, oh, Okay. You know what? I didn't even realize that those were stools. I thought they were just regular chairs. I never took notice of that before. I should probably replace those with regular chairs. Uh, okay. For some reason, these two don't really like to discuss marriage all that much. Maybe it's not in the cards for them. Because <clears throat> last time she brought it up and he didn't like it. And this time he brought it up and she wasn't really interested. So maybe we should just drop it. <laughs> maybe we should stop with that. Uh, Genesis. Land grab power company safety alert. Due to squirrels, we are going to turn off your power sometime in the next 40 48 hours. Are you prepared? Oh, they just shut it off anyway. I said no. And they said, well, too bad. We're turning off your power right now, actually. I hope you're stocked up on books and candles. Have a nice day. What? <laughs> I've never seen this before. This is completely new. And also kind of rude. Um, how long does this last for? All right, then. I guess we're having a little power outage. Uh, let's go talk to Lana. Ask her how her day was. Um, hug lovingly. And... Tell her a funny story. Just do some dad stuff. And then I'm gonna have her do homework. Oh wait, she doesn't have any homework. Um, we have a bookshelf somewhere, I'm sure. Yeah, there's one right here. Actually, I don't think we can access that bookshelf. It doesn't look like it. So maybe we'll use a different one. There's a stack of books here. Nope, you can't interact with it. Okay, well, either way, there are some. there's a bookshelf up here in the baby's room, so we can just use that. Go down to homework. See, there's only the, um, hmm. Okay, that's interesting. There's only the, the, there it is. Oh, it starts with a G, grade school homework. Okay, because under homework, I only saw the, um, the high school one, so that was confusing. Uh, I'm going to put that in her inventory and have her do her homework. And I guess, oh, she's eating pancakes. I was going to say, I guess we should order pizza or something because we can't cook. But looks like Malibu's got that figured out already. She just grabbed a plate of leftovers. Um, we really, we have one candle going right there. Uh, oh, we should close the clinic. It's been open for a while. Oh my god, 2,360 simoleons. That's actually really good. We should probably do a day at the clinic where we actually go in. I still want, uh, even though we have the well-managed perk point, I still would like for her to manage it. Or not manage it, but uh, go in there and... Uh, yeah, I guess it would be manage it because I still want to increase our ratings if we can. So I won't always have them run the clinic that way. Um, oh, he's already helping her with her homework. Good. He's he's a very good dad. Uh, 
Okay, um, what else can we do here? There's like, <laughs> there's nothing to do because the power is out. So we could, we could always take the dog for a walk. Let's go do that. Uh, what is this little cupcake thing? Craving sweet food from pregnancy. Oh, okay. Well, we could always go find like a food vendor on our walk. Okay, so once she's done her homework, she can grab some leftovers too. And we're going to go on a short walk. And then uh, we'll see if we can find a cupcake stand because she's craving some sweet food. Um, there is this thing here, um, but nothing sweet available buy pet food. I didn't realize you could actually do that. Order a drink. Yeah, that is very exciting. <laughs> I thought for sure they would have something sweet, but all they had was like fish tacos. Um, is there another vendor? Probably not. I would say that's probably it for food vendors. Um, we can always check back. Maybe the menu will change up a little bit. Okay. Um, Jace got some pancakes. Lana did as well. Yeah, that's good enough. All right, uh, upstairs in the dark, <laughs> because it is still dark in here, and she can go play with her toys for a bit. Um, what was um, Jace doing? I don't think I was playing. Whoa, that was a jam-packed calendar. Um, Anyway, <laughs> there's a lot going on there. Uh, Jace is eating his pancakes. Then I guess we will clean out the fridge because there's some spoiled food in there. And we're still on our walk. Um, let's go check this one more time. Yeah, okay, nothing sweet still. <sighs> this girl, she just wants a cupcake. Like, <laughs> what is she supposed to do? I guess we could always go to a restaurant or something, but that is so not worth it. You know what? We could make our own desserts. Let's go home. Oh, no, wait. The power is out. Never mind. I was thinking she could go home and make some cookies or some brownies, but uh, not when the power is out. And there was... Oh, never mind. The power is back on. So let's let's go make some... Let's bake something. Um, we're going to make sugar cookies. What are you doing? He came stomping in here. Chat with Lana. Insult her? No, 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 don't do that. Oh, you jerk. I don't know why he would do that. That didn't make a whole lot of sense. This poor girl, she's just in here playing with her toys by herself. Hopefully this will satisfy her craving, which of course has gone away now. So this whole thing is kind of a waste of time, but that's, that's fine. <laughs> That's fine. Um, what other like wishes does she have? Be funny. Uh, likes baking. Yeah, that could be kind of fun. <clears throat> Mentor a child. Chat with crush. Okay, well, we can't still have a crush on Junior Watson. We haven't seen him since high school. And she's now with someone else. Just waiting on these cookies. We want them so bad. Oh, they don't look very good. <laughs> Uh, she is new to the baking skill, so that's understandable. Grab a serving. Jace, you can get some too. Jace was in a really bad mood earlier. Irrational hatred for the sun from high maintenance trait. That's so for the sun. I must be high maintenance because I am a freak and I also hate sunlight. <laughs> Maybe I'm a vampire. I don't know. I hate, I just hate being too hot. Um... I don't know. I, I'm a like rainy day kind of girl. That's, that's my, that's what I'm all about. I'm going to put these in the fridge, even though they're really bad. Um, Lana can have some in the morning if she wants. Also, uh, it looks like she's still quite hungry. So I think we're going to have like a quick meal, maybe just, um, acai bowl. I didn't even know that was an option. Let's have that. What are you doing? Oh, he's probably beating up that teddy bear. You really need to go to bed and reset for tomorrow because you have been kind of a nightmare. <laughs> oh, that actually looks delicious. Okay, well, she took a bite, so it was hard to see, but that did really look really good. 
And then we're going to send you to bed because her back is super sore. Um, I do want them to have a better quality bed. Um, this bedroom to me, just it's not doing it for me. I'm going to make some changes to that. Uh, the, <clears throat> the chair at the vanity is like supposed to be an outdoor chair. So that's kind of odd. Okay, well, I feel like Dodger just woke her up. That's exactly what was happening. Okay, so uh, Lana is finally asleep. And maybe we'll go to the clinic tomorrow. I kind of doubt it, though, because with her being so heavily pregnant, she has more needs. And speaking of high maintenance, I just don't think that's going to be the right move for her. So I guess we'll spend another day at home. I think the baby is going to be coming very soon anyway. Third trimester in 15 hours. And she's having another craving for sweet food. So... Um, those cookies, they were not very good, but we could still, um, snack on those in the morning. And then also it's Tuesday. Will Jace be going to work? Yes. He works from nine to six. Okay. Hopefully he gets promoted easily in that job because I feel like he's a little bit behind. He's almost an adult and, um, he's, he was unemployed for that entire time. So <laughs> we need to get a little bit more ahead. <clears throat> okay. He can get ready for his day and you as well. I'm going to have her go to the washroom and then come serve some breakfast. And then hopefully that'll be ready for when uh, Lana gets up. I'm going to have her come and wait for this bathroom. I, for some reason I thought I wasn't going to enjoy having a child in the home that like wasn't part of the, the, I shouldn't say part of the family. That's a little bit harsh, but I mean, she's not biologically related. Uh, she's kind of just an extra. I thought it was going to be a bit of a nuisance to be perfectly honest, but I kind of like it actually. And I think that, um, I think that Malibu would make a very solid effort to be a really good parent to Lana. And I'm hoping those two will have a good relationship. Okay. Jace, are you still in a bad mood? Uncomfortable. Poseidon's kiss from high maintenance trait. I may have to get rid of that trait. That is just not a, a good time. <laughs> that is not fun at all. Um, okay, warm yourself up then if that's what you're complaining about. He's always in a bad mood because of that trait. So I might swap it out. I can kind of see him having the family oriented trait because he did um, adopt Lana. Um, just kind of, I guess it's not unusual for a single guy to adopt a child, but I mean, I've never seen it in The Sims, so he must have really wanted a family. Oh. Lana is patiently waiting for her breakfast. I think Malibu is putting in a really good effort to, to take good care of Lana. Okay, grab a serving. Jace, um, he needs to leave in like an hour and a bit. <clears throat> and I really do want to go to the clinic, but the problem is, um, her needs are not very good, and I just don't know if she would have a very good day. Um, share big news. We have definitely already done that. Uh, where are we at now with this? Third trimester begins in nine hours. So we do have some time. So I actually think I am going to send her to, um, to the clinic. Lana is off to school. Okay. And we will travel to the vet clinic. Okay. So we are here. What does the clinic look like? Is it a mess? No, it's not. It's actually really good. Okay. <laughs> I was a little bit nervous about that, but it actually looks really nice. So we can open the clinic. There's one little uh, spot that needs to be mopped up. The rest of it looks pretty good. Um, Jace has gone to work, so I'll have him work hard. Not really sure what their schedules are going to look like day to day. Um, I kind of plan on having Malibu be like a very involved parent, especially when the kids are really young. So for now, okay, she's gonna have to pee a lot throughout the day. Uh, for now, I'm thinking that we'll probably just, uh, hold on. Where's Ayumi? Did she die? No, she's over there. Uh, for now, I'm thinking we'll just, um, work whenever we can, maybe a couple days a week, but that should be enough. Let's go greet this patient. Unfortunately, only the impatient option is available. And then also because she's level 10 now, 
it's much easier to uh, diagnose a pet. So hopefully this won't take too long. Also, uh, soothing the pets is another thing we need to work on as well. And treatment is actually the Parasite Killer Spray. Olive is calling again. Let's go to GeekCon. No, thank you. Also, you know what? <laughs> I just realized we haven't... She hasn't seen her little sister um, since she was born. And Venice would now be... Um, how old would she be? Let's let's find Venice. I don't think she'd be a teen just yet. Okay, I cannot find this girl. <laughs> we have we know so many dogs. There she is. That's Venice right there. We should definitely invite her over. Um, it's kind of odd that we just ignored her. <laughs> I forgot that she existed. Treat patient. Or not. Why is that not working? Oh, did somebody already help that? No, oh, no, it's not. Begin examining Penny. Okay, um, we will take temperature, skin and fur, check the chart. Probably don't even need to do that many, actually, because usually just it's two interactions and then you've got the diagnosis. There we go. Not so bad. Malibu has completed examining. All right. Do need to keep an eye on her uh, her needs. Are you being helped? Yes. Okay. Not you though. <clears throat> yeah. She's gonna have to eat pretty soon. Um, doing this while pregnant does involve a bit more care. Um, we're gonna take care of Hasley now. So calm the patient. I feel like just one more. There we go. I love how quickly we can treat patients now. It's just like in and out. So much faster. Cured sickness. And then we have some other patients waiting. Invite to feel baby. I just thought about how weird that would be to go up to your patient and demand that they touch your belly. <laughs> so weird. But yeah, she is like very heavily pregnant. I'm very excited for this baby girl. I think I think I've got a pretty good name in mind. There we go. So fast. I mean, it's 2.30 and we've already helped like five patients. So we're doing pretty good. Malibu has completed examining. Um, we'll just run to the washroom and then I don't know if we have food upstairs in the fridge, but if we do, we should grab some. Yeah, we do. Okay. Uh, Lana is done with school for the day, so we could even just close down and go home. Um, I don't want her to stay here until she's in a really bad mood and all her needs are completely depleted. I, I don't want that. So maybe we could stay and help just one more patient. Um, greet patient. I wish that she was in a better mood. She's always in a bad mood. Um, it's very rare that we can greet the patients warmly. And I'm sure that doesn't help with our reviews. Okay, this will be our last patient for the day. You know what? No. <laughs> I'm not going to mess with this today. I don't feel like chasing this cat down for treatment. Um, so 650 simoleons. I'm also going to fire Mayumi or Ayumi because I think she's old. <laughs> that's a horrible, that's ageist. That's really bad. But honestly though, I don't know. I just don't think she's that helpful. Sorry. It's, it's definitely because of your age. Well, she's going to die soon. We need to find someone who's got more energy. Um, let's hire another sim. We're going to go, can I, I would love to be able to see their age. Rico, Yuna, Ethan. Um, let's go with Rico. And then we're going to promote her to level two right away. Doesn't even have to come in for a, her first day of work. And we have 615 points. So we've got vet rush. I, I honestly, I, I don't want that. 
I don't want the vet rush. And it looks like it's actually pretty clean in here, so we're ready to go. Can we interact with what's his face? I don't think we can because he's not technically working right now. Okay. Um, I'm going to end this episode here. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, please give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.